Okay. So here's the second video. And I thought it was fitting. So since it's the second video, we do two pigtails. Sounds good, huh? Yeah, sounds good. Sounds good. Okay, so just like before, we're using a brush, a comb, and I have this little pick end. I don't even know, really, really know what it's called. And then we're going to have two sets of hair ties. One set of clear little hair ties. That's to keep it, to keep the hair nice and tight. And this is, this set is colored to go with whatever she's wearing. Yeah. Purple doesn't exactly go with pink, but this is just a demonstration anyways. <laughs> so, it hey. goes with this. A little bit. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So, just like before, with the comb, um, or with the brush, I mean, we're going to go straight back. Yeah, you sure do. Um, and again, this is easier uh, to do in the morning, right after, right after a bath. Um, that way, uh, I don't know if you put conditioner in your daughter's hair, but if you do, it makes things so much easier. Um, and then she's, she's nice and relaxed. All that other good stuff. Okay, keep your head still, please. Okay. So... Um, after we're done combing the hair straight back, what we're going to do is comb it back, comb it straight back one more time with the, with the comb. There you go. Straight back to the back of the head. And so this is finer. This is a, a finer uh, tooth comb than the brush. That way, that way you'll, uh, you'll get all the hair. It's now, much easier. Much easier, huh? Yeah. Much easier. Yeah. Um, now, I'm going to show you guys. Now, what we're going to do is um, look at the back of the head, and then we're going to kind of part it with our fingers. And then we're going to look in the mirror and find the center of the face. And make sure that the center of the hairline that we're that we're making with our fingers is center with the face. Okay, I know this is a little more difficult than the first one, but uh, it's definitely very very cute. Okay, so we're gonna grab the hair just like that, and then we're gonna hold it. Okay, hold it just like that, and then with the comb, we're gonna brush the other side away from it, away from our fingers. Okay. Just like that. And then I'm gonna hold on, baby, don't move. And then I'm gonna grab the other side and then brush it down. Okay? And then just kind of work it and split the hair in half. Split the the two um the two sides of the hair of the head. I don't know how to explain it. In half. Okay? So at this point, look at the camera bit. Now look down. It should look just like that, straight down the middle. Okay? Very good. So, after that's done, you have to split it again, more than likely have to split it again, in the back. Now the back is just a little bit harder because um, a lot, oftentimes there's, a, like, um, there's little cowlicks uh, there on the back and sometimes the hair doesn't lay um, symmetrically. So, like Elizabeth's hair is a little bit difficult because she has like a little cowlick right here in the back. So, part of her hair is going this way and part of her hair that should be going this way is going this way as well. A little difficult, but you can still manage. Okay, so you just want to grab the comb and just kind of uh, manipulate the hair. And make it go where, where you want it to go. Okay. Mama, mama, mama. My eye is falling out. Your eye's not falling out. Oh, Apparently no. her eye's falling out. Anyways, so after that's done, you're going to grab the hair in one hand, just like we did before, but this time we're just going to do it in two parts, okay? So grab the hair, go like that, and then just kind of uh, even everything out, because everything's, all the hair is not, definitely not going to be cooperating at first. 
Okay. Grab it like this. Grab the rest of her hair. My eyes are bleed. Your eyes not gonna bleed. As you can see, just being a little, a little gentle, but then again a little rough, because you kind of have to be a little rough with her hair, um, but not so rough as is making her uncomfortable. And don't worry, sometimes you will make her uncomfortable. Sometimes they'll pull the hair a little bit too much, but sometimes you just can't avoid those things. So bear with it and practice. That's all. Um, Okay, so once you have, once you have a good even brush or a good even um, amount of hair in your hand and it's all nice and not lumpy, you grab your, your uh, clear or uh, at least a color rubber band that you don't care about. Get between your fingers like this, just like before. Grab it and tie it in there. One more time for good measure. There, okay. Then, one more time, grab the comb, or grab the brush, one of those, grab a colored rubber band, and again, this is just for fashion, just for, uh, just to go with what, her, what she's wearing. And there you go, that's one side. Now we're going to do the other side. other side, there's not much difference. The only difference is the hair on this side is out of the way. That's really the only difference. So again, we're going to grab the hair like this, comb up into the hand, and then just uh, manipulate the hair and get it into, your, into that one hand. And uh, oftentimes you're not going to have these at the same uh, the same distance apart, or they're going to be lower, one's going to be lower or higher, or further back than the other, and uh, again, it just takes practice, just like anything else in the world. Right, love? Yeah. Right. I forgot this side. I forgot that side? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, like that. Okay. Just like this, like this one. Yeah. Can you tell everybody to keep practicing? To so keep practicing, everybody. Keep, keep pass, practicing, everybody. <laughs> Just about. You got it. Okay. And then once you have it, once you have your hand where you think the first one should be, or is. Um, then just grab it in one hand, just like the other side. Got the clear one first. Grab that hair. Go into a, that ponytail. My eyes hurting. Your eyes hurting, huh? I'm gonna itch it. Okay. And this is far from perfect, but it just goes to show that mm. nobody's perfect. And this is just a this is just a uh, tutorial, anyways. And then again, grab the the <laughs> grab the colored uh, hair tie. Wrap that a couple of times. Pull it tight. Come back. And then, if you want, bring the bangs down. If your daughter has that, has the bangs, and that'll look pretty cute. And, hold on, these aren't exactly, these aren't ideal, but, just goes to show, everything comes with practice, okay? See? See how that looks? Okay. Say bye-bye. I like to go like this. Say bye-bye. Bye-bye.